The race to build quantum computers has been called the dawn of a new era in science. Machines that could solve problems no supercomputer on Earth could ever check. But a new study out of Swinburne University has just cracked open the most uncomfortable question of all. What if these machines are giving us the wrong answers? The team tested a class of devices known as Gaussian boson samplers, machines that use photons of light to perform calculations beyond the reach of classical systems. These devices have been at the center of claims that quantum advantage had already been achieved. But when researchers put those claims to the test, the results didn't line up. The data coming out of these systems did not match the theoretical predictions. Even more alarming, some of the noise and errors in those experiments made their results closer to what a classical algorithm could mimic. In other words, the quantum machines may have lost the very property that made them powerful in the first place, their quantumness. The Swinburne team has now shown a way to check these systems in minutes, something previously thought impossible. Their validation methods reveal where the errors are creeping in and whether the machines are producing anything truly quantum at all. The findings raise serious doubts about some of the biggest claims in the field and suggest that the race for real quantum advantage is far from won. For now, the promise of error-free quantum computing looks more fragile than ever.